sympathetic vibration and resonance. We're going to shift gears again. Here's another example of sympathetic vibration. The engineers who studied this phenomenon said that it was resonance that brought this bridge down. They believe that they, the wind that was blowing up the Tacoma the Arrows is actually going through the girders and playing the frequency of the metal and the concrete in the bridge. There's an engineer, uh, there's a lot of people say, yeah, this guy, there's a dog in this car out there, and this guy went out to rescue the dog but wasn't able to, and you'll see him walking in here in a minute. He's actually one of the engineers that designed the bridge and he understood what was going on, so he drove his car out there to detune the bridge to try to save the bridge. Isn't that amazing how much that's swinging? That's real time. That's real. That's as it's happening. Because you'll see him walk in, he has a pipe in his hand. Oh, la di da di da. Well, that didn't work. I hate it when that happens. So there's his car. Okay, bye bye to the car. Bye bye car. Because eventually, it can't keep up anymore and it destroys itself. This is where they, after this event, is when they started uh, incorporating acoustic engineering into the building of large structures. Because they knew how important it was to consider sound and all the other vibrations that could be caused by wind, the oscillation that wind could create, uh, the whole bit. <coughs> 